Non-plant people are so cute. They just don't get it. They don't know, you know? Ryan, my sweet, sweet husband on my birthday came home with some plants for me and I was thrilled. I'm still thrilled, don't get me wrong. But I had a little chuckle when he walked in through the door and I went to touch this plant to feel the soil as we plant people do right away. And I noticed that every single one of these rocks is glued down. <laughs> Non-plant people, that's all I can say. They those guys. I think that plants like this, I don't know what it is, but plants that are glued down like this, painted succulents, don't even get me started on those, really catch the eyes of non-plant people for some reason. So, I mean, this just looks really put together and it is because everything is cemented into place. So this poor little succulent is trapped. I mean, even look at how, how glued in this is, like even the tag won't come out. <laughs> laugh to keep from crying. Since I do think that the odds of plant people getting gifts from their non-plant friends like this are pretty high, I'll show you what I do to break this up and pretty much rescue the plant that's been glued into the pot. Let's do this. I do have some tools here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to need because the amount of glue on these puppies kind of varies. So I just have like this little screwdriver thing, um, some pliers, and then like a corkscrew slash knife so basically let's just do this you just want to yep yeah, that's definitely not going to work got also grabbed this little tool i don't know what it is it's like some type of fancy like knife thing but i'm not fancy enough to use this i'll stick with my butter knife this is now a plant tool and what i'm going to do <laughs> i'm literally just gonna breaking it up Is this weird if I'm like double filming? This is filmception. Do 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 do. It would be ideal. It would definitely be ideal to do this outside, but the weather is terrible. So inside it is. You could also use a hammer for this if you want, but I couldn't find the hammer. So this is just gonna suffice. This is actually a really great tool. Step number one, pound the heck out of the pebbles with whatever tool you can. I'm actually going to gather all the little pebbles and put them in this bowl. I'm going to put it in the soil that I'll be repotting. Poor little baby in. I think that I'll really like the, the little pebbles in there, but first we need to clean them because they do have glue and who knows what else they have on there. Get as many of them out as you possibly can. Okay, so I got most of the pebbles out and at the bottom of the pebbles, um, I don't know if any of you have ever repotted one of these, but there are usually, there is usually some like sand down there. And in this case, it is really, really glued down. At this point, the glue is even on the soil itself. So I am just going to completely get rid of this soil. The best bucket for this soil. The garbage. I wouldn't wish this soil on my weediest, ugliest garden, to be honest. Yeah, this paper is barely pulled, being able to pull out because there's so much glue. Like I would say probably the top few inches of soil is glued down. Why? It's not your fault, but why? So we're just gonna get rid of all this. Sorry, little planty. Oh my gosh. Update. The top few inches of soil is glued. Okay. This is one clump. Like I can't break this up. It is completely glue. But not only that, there is a layer of just regular soil. At the bottom, it's also glued. Why? No offense. I'm just going to sit you in here for a second. <laughs> Look. It is glued. This is not coming off. Oh my gosh. I have to break some of the roots. Oh no. Use your muscles. Okay, this is gonna come in handy. <sighs> Trying to break up the glue. <laughs> it's not really working. It's hard because it's so it's so glued, but I don't want to harm the roots, you know? Poor little planty. Ryan's so funny. He came home with a few plants for me for my birthday and he hands them to me and he goes, Well, they have a lot of really cool plants at Lowe's right now. You should go look at them. Uh, I got these plants and it made me realize that your plant collection kind of sucks. Those were his words. <laughs> oh, these roots are so small. It's cute. Okay. We can work with this. There we go. Got most of the soil off of those roots. I bet this feels so nice to be able to breathe. There's also rocks stuck along the outside. I'm going to try and scrape off unsuccessfully, it seems like. Now I have all the rocks cleaned. 
All the soap is off of them. All the glue is, I think, off of them. I let them soak for quite some time. And then I washed them with dish soap, but now we are going to mix this in with our soil. So here I have black gold soil mixed with a tiny bit of orchid bark and then perlite as well. And I'll link all these products down below. And I'm also going to mix some of these little rocks in. I think this plant will really, really like it. So I'm just gonna dump all of it in and I'm gonna use my new favorite gardening tool that I don't even know what it's called and mix this all in really well. You can also, if you don't have like little pebbles like this, but I'm assuming if you're repotting your glue plant, of course you have the pebbles, but if you're not able to save them, you can also put pumice in it and succulent type plants really, really enjoy that pumice. Alrighty. So now I'm just gonna pot him up like normal. He'll be such a happier plant now. Okay, so I filled it up to here, plop her in, and now just fill in all around it, like so. And then kind of bounce it um, to help everything settle. Perfect, then I'm just going to give it a little bit of water uh, because I don't know when the last time it had water was all of those rocks were glued on top And I don't know how well water would be able to seep on down there But anyway, I know this was kind of a random short weird whatever little video Yeah, let me know what you thought of it. I hope it was like fun at least if nothing else fun That is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next one